Good morning ma'am. My name is Ashwini Kumar of class 5th F. Today I am going to share with you my picture story. My picture is a beautiful scene of a river size. The title of my story is Picnic on a Beach. The story goes like this. One summer morning, three friends Brandon, Nicholas and Amelia are out for picnic. They decide to take some wonderful things with them. They take a basket full of sweets, chocolates, juice, chips and cold drinks. That was enough after a heavy breakfast. They also take their fishing rods to do some fishing on the beach. Brandon also took his book to read on the beach. He is wearing a white and red t-shirt and blue pants. He is reading a book of jokes, eating chips and having cold drinks. They decide to have a full day of enjoyment. They are in a small deck just built near the beach. Nicholas says, I got a fish. He pulls it out. Everyone starts laughing. It is a shoe. The sun is setting, so they have to go home. Emilia has also taken some beautiful pictures of her friends. Everyone is happy. Thank you and have a nice day. Good morning. I, Shruti Datta of Class 5C, is going to share my picture story with all. In this, the main characters are Sita and Geeta. The topic of my story is traffic jam on New Year. Once, Sita and her sister Geeta were out for celebrating the New Year. As they reached the market, they were astonished to see the rush there. People were going here and there, vehicles after vehicles and car after cars. Everyone was rushing to buy something or a gift to a friend. Some were running towards the hotels and the restaurants with friends for a New Year party. Children were laughing and having fun. Sita and Geeta also enjoyed themselves. It was slightly cool, not very cool, they, and they were enjoying themselves. They saw someone sitting on a car bonnet. One child, one child was driving a cycle and singing away. Two old men were laughing and talking. Some were rushing home. They both, they both also enjoyed the New Year sweets and ice creams. Then they decided to go back home, taking some gifts for their parents, for their father and mother. Their parents blessed them. Thank you. Good morning, respected teachers and all my dear friends. My name is Saisha Singh. I am from class 5th A. My house is Pandit Nehru House. I study in Army Public School, New Kent, Prayagraj. Today, I am going to narrate a story before you. The title of my story is Wonderland Theme Park. It was a bright sunny day when my parents took me to a park where people were doing many activities like hiking, trekking, boating, kayaking, horse riding, angling, fishing, meeting, playing games and many more such things. Inside the water, Boats, kayaks, animals and many other things were cluttered in the first half of the show to demonstrate as to how difficult it is to perform all the activities at one place. Later it was explained that we must do different activities at different places earmarked for specific activity. We should never try to mix up everything. Otherwise we will not be able to focus on anything. Moral of the story is, take one activity with full focus to succeed, be organized and planned. Thank you. Good morning, respected teachers and my dear friends. My name is Samira Singh. I am from class 5th A. My house is APJ Abdul Kalam House. I study in Army Public School, New Kent, Prayagraj. Today, I am going to narrate a story before you. The title of my story is, Follow Traffic Rules. An awareness camp was organized to make the people aware of following the traffic rules at Prayagraj UP civil lines. For this, the local authorities organized a demonstration by the local administration and traffic police where no one was following the rules. Vehicles were moving at their own. Vendors were selling goods, vegetables on the road. No one was wearing helmets 
and not following traffic lights. This all was enough to create a big mess up in the form of traffic jam, accidents, avoidable rush and inconvenience to everyone. After this, a pledge was taken by the people to follow traffic rules properly as they never want to face such situation due to any such practice ever in future. Moral of the story, we must follow the traffic rules at all times. Thank you. Good morning, respected teachers and my dear friends. I am Shivansh Morya from Class 5G. Today, I am going to tell a short story on traffic rules. The title of my story is Traffic Rules. One day, I was going to school on my bicycle with my friends Lovely and Shriyansh. On the crossroad, there was a lot of traffic. We waited, but we got stuck in the jam. After a while, there were many accidents because people were not following the traffic rules. On that day, we could not go to school. After reaching home, I told my father about the situation. Then, my father wrote an application to municipal commissioner complaining about the traffic. Some action was taken that on every crossroad, there was traffic police controlling traffic. On the next day, we went to school on time. The moral of the story is, traffic rule is most important. Good morning respected teachers and all my dear friends. My name is Surat Yadav. I am from class 5G. I am going to narrate a story before you. The title of my story is Me and the Traffic. Once upon a time, I was going to my village. I was going to my village by a bus. After some time, we got stuck in traffic. I saw a policeman who was checking the pollution of Scooty. And two men were drink men were drinking juice in the middle of the road i saw a traffic signal but no one is following the rules there was no discipline here after 30 minutes a traffic policeman came and came and handled all the traffic now i was happy the moral of this story is together we can make many things wonderful if we Join hands. We can make things happen in wonderful way. Thank you and have a nice day. The father and the two children. The father name is Rahul and the brother and the boy name is Raghu and his younger sister name is and his younger sister name is Pinky. They were going at the bank of the river. They have, they have chosen a place and said they were seeing that a boat race is going on. There was, a, there was a boy who was sitting on a horse and catching fishes. There was a and there was another boy who was floating on a tube, a tube and uh, had, with a pet dog Johnny. He was so happy and the boy was relaxing on a tube. There was a hen was floating on a, a tub. There were so many boats. There were colorful boats and another bank of river. There was a, another boat for emergency the, and the back of the and the back of the boats and there are a ship and then a squirrel also there and the seal also there at the rock and they were enjoying and seeing the boat race while eating uh, their food there was a rabbit also and another bank of the river there was one family also they were doing campfire at the at the near of the their camp and the captain was saying that anyone is doing cheating at the last the girls team was winning and there was happy and the father was relaxing and the children are cheering for their and they went to the home at evening and tell to their mother all about the day thank you good morning teachers and all my dear friends my name is Amo. i study in class 5b my room number is 4 today i am going to tell a story on sunday children were gone to store room of school there were Many stationary items and books there. Some children want stationery and some children want a book. 
or or reading a book one girl is taking out cardboard boxes one girl is taking books and putting into the cart one girl is telling a children to do work and rest of the children were reading books or or wants a stationery and doing like this they have cleaned the storeroom thank you and have a nice day